three. Back iron, no good. Rebounded on the backside by Murphy. Grayson Murphy weaving his way, dumps it off. Richard drives, and he's fouled, and it's Shamar Wright this time. So back to the free throw line goes Belmont. At the line for Belmont, shooting two, number four, Will Richard. First shot is in for Richard, the current OVC freshman of the week, 6'5 freshman out of Fairburn, Georgia. Second shot rattles home. Shamar Wright fires from three and hits. Underneath, backside, won't go. It is loose, it is out of play, and it's going to belong to no signal yet. Now they do say it's Belmont basketball. 5-4, SIUE on top after the three from Shamar. Here's Shepard, pulls up his dribble, top of the key, backdoor cut. Richard couldn't get it to go, and the rebound for SIUE. Pruitt threw it away. Goodness. Nice rebound from Pruitt, the redshirt freshman. But then the pass was not where he wanted it. SIUE by a, a point. Richard again, driving. Hands off, Musinski lost it. Cougars have it back. It's Shamar Wright up ahead, and that's knocked out of play, and that will be Belmont basketball. This has been an ugly start to this one. That's the third turnover for SIUE. Belmont's got a turnover as well. As Courtney Carter checks in, Lamar Wright checks out. In the corner it goes for Smith. Preseason all OVC pick. Here's Richard. Right side, Shepard. Lob in for Musinski. Mid post, right side, trying to get in the lane. He'll just back up and hit, and he missed it. It's rebounded by Taylor, but thrown out of bounds. That's another defensive rebound, and then a pass out of play. Pruitt did it, and now Taylor's done it. Four minutes gone here in the first half as Grayson Murphy, the preseason co-player of the year in the OVC, brings it ahead. Shepard on the left. Back left for Smith now. Skips it across court. Murphy, Shepard drives and got it. Lays it in with the right hand. Fifteen thirty-five to play. Pruitt lost the basketball. It's picked up by Smith. Smith across the timeline. Ahead for Murphy. Out for Shepard. Three coming. Front iron no good. Offensive rebound. Second effort good for Smith. Into the corner for Carter. Carter will take it on the baseline. Carter pulls the dribble up, kicks it out. Shamar right, second of the night, not there for him. Rebounded by Murphy. Murphy, long pass ahead. Shepard catches short corner out for Wood just in the game. Around it goes for Will Richard. Back for Murphy. Shepard again on the wing. There's Jackie Besick. 
Jacoby Wood to the foul line, picks his dribble up. Out for Richard, three, no good. Carter rebounds ahead for Taylor. Rayshon on the right wing for the Cougars. For Courtney Carter. Carter for Pruitt, right back. And now round on a screen, kick out now. Doss, three, missed everything. Murphy's got it again. Murphy to the foul line, picks up his dribble. Baseline for Jackie Bisek. He's doubled, ball is loose, but Shepard's got it. Murphy on the left. There's Jackie Bisek again, and Doss bit on it. Pump fake, and he caused, uh, he fouled, rather. That's how you mean foul number 21. That's his first. Third of the night for the Bruins. Frank Jack Ubisic, a 6'8 sophomore from up the road in Cary, Illinois, out of Cary Grove High School. Uh, he bounces one off the rim. Ten points in last year's matchup here in Edwardsville. He has only been to the free throw, or the free throw line, rather. This is his fourth attempt. And he's now two out of four this year at the free throw line. Evan Bronze is in now, the Iowa City product. Ten five, Belmont on top. Pruitt. Carter. Back for Pruitt. He'll try a three, and that one is no good. Doss rebounds, it's popped out of play. Shamar Wright throws it in, and Taylor couldn't save it. Now a long pass ahead for Wood, and his ball won't go, but Belmont keeps it. Shepard from the right elbow is good. It's an 8-0 run for the Bruins. It's a 12-5 lead for Belmont. Courtney Carter. For Pruitt again. Pruitt's going to drive baseline. Pruitt strong off the glass. That breaks up that 8 0 run for the Bruins. Cuts the lead back to 12 7. Jacoby Wood on the left wing. Top of the key, Bronze. Murphy back for Bronze. Missed it off the glass. Pruitt rebounds for SIUE. His third of the game. Carter brings it across the timeline. Work it against Murphy. Carter around a screen. Right back for Pruitt. How about a three for Dewan Pruitt? No good. Rebound knocked out, popped up in the air, picked off by Murphy. He shuffles back for Richard. His three is short. Pruitt rebounds again. Rayshon Taylor's going to drive. Taylor to the basket, missed it. And the rebound for Wood. SIUE wanted a foul. Shepard on the right wing. Wood now between the circles for Murphy. Murphy skips it back for Shepard. Three on the way. Good. Uh, second three-point basket of the game for Shepard. Check it. It's his first. It's the second for the Bruins. 15-7. Conference team going through the issues. Tennessee Tech's had a bunch of games postponed. Here's Carter. The reverse is good for Courtney Carter. Right off the inbounds play. That trims the lead back to six. E.J. Bellinger in the game now for Belmont. They double-team Musinski, who picks it out into the corner for Pearson. Smith up top. He'll try the three. That missed. Curtis had the rebound, but it's out of play. And it's going to be out off of Musinski. So SIUE will keep it. Jonathan Curtis, the freshman out of Mooresville, North Carolina. Courtney Carter right at the edge of the center circle for the Cougars. Guarded closely by Jacoby Wood. Now it's Taylor on the wing. Taylor's going to turn the corner. Baseline jumper, and he's fouled. Rayshon will go to the free throw line. He's shooting 81% at the line this year. That is third best in the OVC. No points yet tonight for Rayshon. 
First free throw is good. Taylor averaging just over 17 points a game, second best among first year players, only behind Paolo Banchero at Duke. And it's less than a point difference as Rayshon Taylor rattles home the second free throw. Four point game, 11 minutes to play. First half, Jacoby Wood hands it away for Bellinger. Bellinger will try a three, missed everything. That was too strong. Here comes Taylor again. Taylor spins through the lane, lost the ball, got it back, got it to Doss. Doss is fouled as he elevates from the free throw line. Bellinger's going to be whistled for the foul. Belmont foul number five, E.J. Bellinger, his first team, second of the half. Second of the half At called the against Belmont. Two, Sean Doss Jr. It was almost as Bellinger was trying to strip him. Doss' first free throw is good. He's coming off a 17-point game at Eastern Illinois on Thursday night. That was his second-best game in an SIUE uniform. Second shot, not there. We've got a whistle, though, and it's a lane violation against Belmont. So Doss will have a second chance. A second chance at his second free throw. So they had brought in a sub. Luke Smith had checked in, but he has to wait. No, maybe not. He was already in. I don't know what they just delayed for there. Here's the second. That one falls. Two-point game now, 15-13, and SIUE is on a 6-0 run. Jacoby Wood, Pearson underneath Musinski. Musinski lost the ball and now he's fouled the second time. Jonathan Curtis will be whistled for the foul. Cougars are mad because he fumbled it the first time. Carter had a partial block the first time, I think. Musinski's shot is good. He's a 75% free throw shooter. Another preseason All-OBC selection for the Bruins. Fourth in the league in scoring right now at just better than 16 points a game. Second shot missed. Curtis rebounds for SIUE. Three-point game. Belmont on top. 10-25 to play. Courtney Carter hands away to Desmond Polk and now back for Rayshon Taylor. Taylor to the left elbow. Taylor underneath for Curtis. Curtis is doubled. Curtis goes up strong. Jonathan Curtis. Trims the lead back to one, 16-15. 10 minutes to play. Murphy, Smith. Wood at the top of the key. Back for Smith. Right side, Pearson now. And it's Murphy in front of the bench. Wood again with 15 to shoot. Here's Murphy splitting his defenders on the scoop with the left hand. Bruins 27th in the NCAA and steals at nearly nine a game, 8.6 per game. They almost had one there. Cam Williams into the game. He's the trigger man as he checks in. Taylor around left, running into Musinski. Carter trying to get around Wood. Taylor again. Taylor. Williams. Cam Williams out onto the wing. Carter. Cam Williams again over top of the defender, and it wouldn't go, and Murphy rebounds. Good ball movement right there from SIUE. They just couldn't get the shot. Entry pass was kicked away by Courtney Carter. Richard and Shepard check back in for the Bruins with 9.04 to play. Shamar back in for SIUE. Taylor sits. 
Musinski's the trigger. And the ball got away, but it's scooped up by Murphy. And now he'll just take a three himself and knock it down. Five for Murphy. The lead out to six for Belmont. Here's Polk at the free throw line and it's knocked away, nearly stolen away. Carter comes away with it. Carter turns the corner under the baseline, lost it out of bounds. Turnover is the seventh tonight for SIUE. Eight and a half to play. Belmont looking to build on a six point advantage. Will Richard between the circles, Murphy. Right side, Pearson. Shepard had it kicked away. Murphy again. Shepard in the corner. Musinski on the baseline, trying to get in the lane. Lost the ball. Cougars have a steal. Ahead it goes. Williams, one catch in the dunk. Man. 21-17. Shepard, one of the three. Into the corner, Pearson will take it and got it. Belmont, four of 12 from three-point range tonight. Lead is out to seven. Here's Williams. Carter. Carter through the lane, scoops it up, got it. Curtis was there for the stick back, but he didn't need to be. Courtney Carter's got four. Five point game, 7.27 to play. First half, Shepard three, too strong. Polk rebounds for SIUE. Polk brings it across the timeline. Top of the key. Picks up his dribble, right. Williams. Trying to go through the lane, ball stolen away. Musinski got his hand on it, and then Carter nearly out of steal, but Murphy comes up with it. Murphy to his left against right. Murphy scoops it up again, missed it. Shamar rebounds. Shamar, top of the key, almost lost it. Polk left corner, three on the way. Missed everything there. Musinski with the rebound. 6.40 left, first half. Shepard from the left. Musinski at the top. He'll try a three. No good. Rebound popped right back to him. Bullet pass underneath, and Richard finishes. Lead back to seven. 6.20 to play, first half. And a time. Smith's got one. SIUE basketball coming out of the timeout. 23 on the shot clock. Pruitt hands to Taylor on the wing. Taylor drives, Taylor to the basket, had his shot blocked. Here comes Murphy the other way for Belmont. Murphy, quick pass ahead, Shepard out onto the wing for Smith. Shepard again now. Murphy at the top. Murphy turns the corner, right side, he lost the ball. Smith, Jackie Bisek underneath. Got it to go off the glass. Lead up to nine for Belmont. Largest lead of the game now for the Bruins. Taylor for Williams. Williams around a Pruitt screen, had the pass taken away. Pruitt's gonna run it down, did so. Here's Shamar, back for Pruitt. A three from the corner, Pruitt hits the three. Seven first half points for Pruitt to bring the Cougars back in this one and Shamar's whistled for a foul as Shepard tried to drive from the baseline. It's just the second three-pointer of the game for the Cougars. Shepard to the free throw line where he's already two of two tonight. Started the night eighth in the league in scoring. He has nine already in the first half, and his first shot is too short. He averages just about 16 a game. Second shot is there, one of two for Shepard. 
The lead to seven. Taylor across the timeline. Around a screen from Pruitt. For Lamar at the foul line. Lamar for his dribble. Back for Pruitt. Pruitt down left side. Glass, good foul. What a first half so far for Dewan Pruitt as well. Nine points for Pruitt on four of six shooting. Four rebounds for the redshirt freshman. He went right up against Jackie Bisick. Laid it in off the glass. I told you, coming on. He has had a really good run of games since being moved into that starting spot. And he knocks down the free throw. And it's 10 first half points for him to match Shepard for game high honors. Jackie Bisick for Murphy on the right. Murphy to the baseline. Jackie Bisek, Smith, Smith. Foul line, Shepard, he'll drive in. Back for Smith in the corner. Smith into the lane, his jumper's good. Has very little arc on that ball, he just pushes. I don't know what was the warning for it. They warned somebody, either a Belmont player or the Belmont bench perhaps, for something. And I don't know what it was for. 31-25, Bruins on top, 4-10 to play in the half. Into the corner it goes, and it's picked off by Murphy as he tries to bring it out against Rayshon Taylor. And he drives. Just uh, got confirmation it was a delay of game uh, that they were that warned for. I guess Belmont was warned for after that basket. 34-25 now, back to a nine-point game, matching the largest lead of the night for the Bruins. Lamar Wright had it knocked away. It's lost out of bounds. SIUE turns it over again. That's the 10th turnover in the first half for the Cougars. Twelve points off of turnovers, and you can make it 15 off of turnovers now for Belmont. And the lead goes to 12, and this is the largest lead of the night for the Bruins. It is not a team that you can afford to make mistakes against. It has never been a team that you can afford to make mistakes against. You make a mistake or you make mistakes against a Belmont team, and chances are you are going to pay for it. They found Pruitt underneath, and Pruitt is fouled. And right now, Belmont making SIUE pay for its mistakes. 15 points off of 10 SIUE turnovers as you see Pruitt fighting for it. And he'll go back to the free throw line. He's been there once tonight already. 6'8", redshirt freshman. Whew, wasn't pretty, but it fell. Sixth in the league now in rebounding after 15 rebounds on Thursday night at Eastern Illinois, which was one shy of SIUE's single game record in the Division I era. Second free throw is there for Dewan Pruitt. He only averages nine points a night, and he's already to 12 with three minutes to play here in the first half. Richard for the Bruins. Right side three, no good. Air ball was caught, though, and kept alive by Grayson Murphy, who's got it on the right side. Murphy for Richard. Inside, Musinski. Posting up against Doss, and he missed it off glass. Shepard flying in for the rebound, and a foul is called. And the foul is called against Doss. So the miss came there. Doss was under the basket. He was in a bad position to try to reach for that. And Shepard comes up short at the free throw line where he's three out of five tonight. Murphy will go to the bench. Shepard's second shot is there. So he's got 11. That matches Smith for a team high. 
Dewan Pruitt's got 12 for a game high for SIUE. Lead is 11 for the Bruins. 2.25 to play first half. Rayshon Taylor around to his left. Taylor into the corner. Carter out for Taylor. Three on the way. Yes, sir. Taylor on the board with a three. He's got five tonight. That brings SIUE within eight. At 38-30, 2.05 to play. Here's Shepard around for Richard. Musinski at the top. Jacoby Wood on the right. Smith catches. Quick shot coming. Good. Luke Smith with the catch and shoot. And he's got 14 tonight. He now leads all scores. Back to 11 for the Bruins. Doss going to drive to his left. And a foul coming up on Shepard. Trying to block him away. Shepard picks up his second personal. Sean Doss Jr. will go to the free throw line. He was recognized before the game for reaching 1,000 points in SIUE's last home game. 842 of those points coming in his time at Arkansas Pine Bluff. But he's been very, very good here in his graduate year for SIUE. Averaging 11.9 points, five and a half rebounds a game. First free throw was good. Second one coming up for Doss. Also good. He's two for two. Trims the Belmont lead to nine. 137 to play here in the first half. Murphy into the front court, hands it away. Nope. Was going to. Thought better of it. Musinski out on the left wing. Around for Murphy. Underneath for Richard. Richard against Pruitt. No. Rebound loose, and Carter picks it off. Here comes Courtney Carter for the Cougars. Out for Williams. A three from the wing. Won't go. Rebound again loose, but Smith grabs it. Crazy throw underneath, and Jacoby Wood finishes. It was not a pretty pass, but it was a pretty finish. Jacoby Wood made the best of it. Carter. Through the center circle, hands it away to Taylor. Taylor looking for the screen and he's tripped. Musinski's gonna be called for the trip. Not sure why he showed some surprise, it was clear. Pleads his case. Taylor will trigger in from the sideline here on the front court. In for Curtis, and hands back to Taylor. Taylor moved to his left. Back to his right around his screen. Give to Curtis off the screen. Curtis trying to get it in the corner. Polk comes up with it. Taylor catch and shoot. Back iron, no good. Rebound out for Murphy. Murphy the other way, quick outlet. The three, good! Luke Smith with another three. He's got 17 first half points, and that's his fifth three-point basket of the half. 15 seconds to play before halftime. Belmont up 14, largest lead of the game for the visiting Bruins. Taylor, stutter steps, lost the ball. Richard, Murphy, three quarters. SIUE starts the second half with the basketball. They move from right to left here in the second period. Just underway, Shamar with it on the, on the wing, picked up his dribble, and he needs help. Lobs it in for Pruitt. Pruitt got way deep, kicks in the corner. Doss for three, short. Murphy rebounds, or Luke Smith rebounds, rather. Murphy will bring it ahead. Murphy to his right. Back cut, Smith lays it up and in. He's not just a long range shooter. Now with 19 just underway in the second half. Taylor for the Cougars. 
for Lamar. For Shamar in the right corner. Pruitt, Taylor again, right back for Pruitt. Pruitt to the basket, got it. 14 for Pruitt. A minute gone. Other end, Musinski couldn't make the play. The ball's out of bounds and it will stay with Belmont. Pruitt has eclipsed his career high in points now as he picked up a block there, probably. Maybe not. He probably should have. Here's Shepard. And around for Smith. Murphy in the corner. Shepard again. That's a two. He was just on the line when he hit that shot. Here's Taylor on the other side. Taylor tried to swing it in the corner and it's deflected out of play. So Pruitt's career best was 13. He scored 13 at Creighton. He scored 13 in the home win against Kansas City, and he's got 14 tonight. He's got it in the corner. He'll hand it back to Taylor. Now he's gonna eyeball a three. It came up short, rebounded backside by Richard. Will Richard skips it across the timeline. Yuzinski, Smith again. Now Murphy in front of the bench. Corner for Shepard. Inside Musinski, rolling to the hoop, and he traveled. <laughs> Taylor will slowly dribble across the timeline. 16-point lead for the Bruins. Largest of the night has been 17 for Belmont. Shamar cutting in. Shamar left hand finish good. Shamar, He's good. fouled. Just five for Shamar Wright this evening. Good find by brother Lamar. Great finish by Shamar. Fighting from a bad angle. Bonus shot on the way for the 62% shooter. And he got it. And that's right about where he is as a career free throw shooter as well. A little pressure from SIUE. Pearson stuck in the backcourt, now ahead for Smith, now Murphy. Richard out for Pearson, three no good. Rebounded by Lamar, here comes Taylor. Taylor driving, Taylor. Picked up his dribble, needs some help. Taylor skips it out. Shamar's got an open look. Got it from three. Nine for Shamar. The lead is 11. Murphy drives in, nails it. Seven for Murphy. Three minutes gone here in the half. 12-point advantage for Belmont. Bruins led by 14 at the break. Rayshon Taylor. Just five points tonight for Taylor. Last game out against the Panthers of Eastern Illinois. Taylor scored just eight. First time in his career he'd not scored in double, scored in double figures. Here's Murphy the other way. Smith, another three. Coming, too strong. Pruitt rebounds for S.I. Inbounds for Murphy. Back underneath for Richard. Richard blocked and goal 10. Oh, a foul is called. No, no, no. They just uh, made the announcement that it's on Pruitt. I don't think it's on Pruitt. I think it should be on Shamar if there's a foul, right? I don't know for sure. The free throw is good. Will Richard at the free throw line. 77% free throw shooter for the year. Four out of four at the line now tonight. Six points for Richard. Second shot on the way. Also good. 
Now six points for Richard. 14 point advantage again for the Bruins. They say that foul was on Pruitt. So they got Pruitt that came before the block by Shamar Wright. Lamar's gonna drive. Missed the shot off the glass, but he draws a foul. Pearson's gonna be called for the foul. Nope. I'm gonna stop anticipating foul calls because I'm not good at it. So Jackie Biesick picks up the foul this time. And interestingly enough, the live stats originally had it on Pearson. So I wasn't the only one that thought it was Pearson with the foul. So the foul gets changed to Jackie Biesick. And Lamar hits one of two. Inside of 16 minutes to play in regulation time, Smith in the corner for, for Murphy. Murphy driving, baseline, reverse, no good. Rebound, knocked out of bounds, it'll belong. Taylor will scoop it up. Bring it into the front court, give it to Doss. Pruitt, right baseline. Taylor around the Pruitt screen. And the pass is taken away. Jacoby Wood easily intercepting that one. Here's Pearson, now Murphy again. Anticipating the pass, taking it away. Eighth steal of the night. Seventh steal, rather. Baseline jumpers too strong. Shamar rips down the rebound for SIUE. Here's Shamar in front of the SIUE bench. Pruitt baseline. Pruitt swings it out. Doss drives in. Pull up. Good. Sean Doss Jr. That's a sweet spot for Sean Doss Jr. And Murphy cutting to the basket. Jacoby Wood with a perfect find. Murphy with nine tonight. Shamar. Taylor on the feed from Pruitt. Oh, he just missed it. Cutting in is Richard. Richard lays it up and down and draws the foul. To the foul line goes Richard. He is four out of four tonight. Eight points coming on two of eight shooting. Free throw up and good. Belmont is the 11 of 15 at the foul line as a team tonight. The lead up to 16 points, which matches the largest lead of the game now for the Bruins. 14 minutes to play. And we've got an offensive foul. Carter driving in and then right before the pass, a little shove off is all it took for an offensive foul. Bruins looking to extend the largest lead of the game. Curtis with a steal. And it's taken right back by Richard. One freshman to another. Curtis picked up the initial. And then Richard. Now it's Jackie Biesick at the top. The weave handoff for Richard. Now Smith. Smith. 
Almost lost it as he spun to his right. Jacoby Wood, Wood drives, lost the ball. Carter the other way. Ahead for Doss. Doss sweeps it to his right and lays it in. 8 for Doss. There's Pearson on the other end. And the handoff knocked away, and it's a moving screen. Offensive foul on Pearson. It's often when, after the handoff, that the player doing the handing off is whistled for the foul. See if we can get an idea of how it went. That's exactly what happened. So Pearson handing off to Richard is whistled for the foul with contact or after the contact. Ooh, high pass. Somehow Taylor came down with it, but he missed the shot. And now the run out. Smith in the lane, lays it in. That's 21 for Smith tonight as he approaches his career high in scoring. Carter for Curtis. Curtis lays it up and in. And a flop warning call. Smith called for the flop, or at least for the warning. Oh, it was actually called that's a technical foul because it goes as a delay of game and they were already warned for a delay of game and so Rayshon Taylor will get a free throw out of it and then SIUE will keep possession I believe free throw good for Taylor he's got six and now I believe no, maybe it's not. I guess it remains Belmont basketball. So you get one free throw out of it, not, and you don't get the possession. It goes as an administrative technical. Sixty-one forty-eight, Belmont on top with the basketball. Murphy. Corner for Shepard, threw it out of bounds. Musinski couldn't keep his hand on it. Carter dribbling across the timeline. 12 minutes to play. A 13 point deficit for the Cougars. Daw spins, lays it off glass and good. 10 for Doss, second and double figures for the Cougars. Lead is 11. Nice cut by Smith, but the ball's taken away. Doss coming the other way, and he's tripped up at midcourt. No call there. Ball loose again. Carter hands it off, and Wright finishes. A little bit of a run now by the SIUE Cougars. It's a 6-0 run inside of a minute, as a matter of fact. Here's Smith into the corner. Richard, baseline. 11 minutes and change to play. Joe Pot with you. Smith in for Murphy, right back for Smith. Into the corner, three on the way is good. Will Richard snaps that 6-0 run by the Cougars with a big three-point basket. His Second of the ball game. That's his first, actually. And already updated the uh, stats before I looked at it. Here come the Bruins again with Richard leading the charge. Richard again. Now it's Murphy out on the left side. Ten twenty-five to play. Musinski lobs in. It's deflected, and the Cougars steal it away. Taylor thought about the three. Now drives, and a foul is called. Belmont 
11 point advantage for the Bruins. Shamar will sit. Taylor in for Carter. Taylor, top of the key, wants to drive, pulls up from the foul line, missed it, ball into the corner, out of bounds. It'll stay with SIUE. Second game in a row where Taylor's not been able to get his points, and tonight it's about as poor of a night shooting as we have seen from Rayshon Taylor. He's one of nine from the floor. At Eastern Illinois on Thursday, it wasn't that he wasn't getting his shots. He did get into foul trouble. So he just actually wasn't in the game a lot. Didn't have a ton of shots. Tonight, he's taken his fair share of shots. He's just missed a lot more shots than we've seen from him for most of the time. He was three of six from the field on Thursday night at Eastern Illinois when he went for eight points. He's got five tonight, six tonight make it, but he's one of nine from the field. Will Richard getting that right knee tended to by the athletic trainer for the Bruins. Has them all patched up, and he'll inbound the ball from in front of the SIUE bench. Ten minutes to play here in Edwardsville. Grayson Murphy across the timeline. Murphy's going to go all the way to the basket, and he lays it up with the right hand. 11 for Murphy tonight. Taylor the other way, in for Curtis. Curtis spins left on the baseline. Got it over two Bruins defenders, including Musinski. Curtis with six tonight. That ties his career high in points. And a whistle. Both teams jawing a little bit after that foul call. Musinski's the trigger. In for Richard, who lays it up. Here's Carter, the other side. Carter lost it. Richard with the steal. Richard almost lost it. Now it's kicked away. Carter's got it back. Carter dumps it out for Polk. Polk tied up. Finds Doss on the right sideline. Shot clock to 15. Doss dribbling through traffic. Had it stripped. Curtis has it. Kicks out. Polk for three. Missed it. Backside rebound for Doss. And he's stripped. Musinski's got it now. But Doss takes it away. Doss is blocked in front of the basket and a foul. And a technical foul is called. A foul underneath, a technical foul followed. I don't know if it was against the SIUE head coach, Brian Baroni, or if it was for someone on the floor. I'm guessing the SIUE bench, maybe not though. It was. The technical came against Musinski. So he picks up a common foul and then a tech, and I assume it was for arguing the call. So at the line, Rayshon Taylor. Rayshon Taylor. So he did not actually pick up a common foul. He actually picked up a clean block. I think that's the way it went, a block. And then he had something to say afterwards, which is amounting to taunting. And that will get you a technical foul these days. One of two for Rayshon Taylor on the technical free throws. 
So Taylor up to seven. SIUE will keep the basketball. Down 12 here with eight and a half to play. Taylor for Curtis. That's pushed out of bounds. It'll stay with SIUE. 11 to shoot for the Cougars. 8.29 to play in the game. Polk is the trigger. Sideline front court in for Taylor. Taylor works against Murphy. And Murphy commits the foul. Belmont's sixth of the second half. Shot clock back to 20 now. Polk's the trigger again. Taylor had it knocked away. Now he drives. Faked the handoff and then got it taken away. Smith hands it off to Murphy. Murphy back out on the perimeter. Shepard right side, inside. Murphy cutting Smith into the corner. Jackie Bisek tied up by Doss. Out onto the wing with five, skipped it right. Smith thought about the three, steps left, and he's blocked. Doss on the run out and a foul. For the most part, it's been a double-digit lead for a good majority of the game and for all of the second half, I think, or at least most of it. Sean Doss Jr. at the foul line, knocks down the free throw. Doss to 11. Again, coming off a 17-point effort Thursday night at Eastern Illinois. Second one on the way, too strong, and it's rebounded by Belmont. Belmont has out-rebounded SIUE tonight, 24-22. SIUE the best rebounding team in the OVC coming into tonight's game. Murphy to the foul line, kicks it out. Smith didn't have the three. Eight to shoot. Murphy to his right, pass knocked away. Doss after the steal. Carter will slow things down. He's just outside the center circle. Seven minutes and change to play here in this one. And a pass taken away. Here's Jacoby Wood by himself from the layup good. Pruitt just a little lackadaisical with the basketball, and Jacoby just picked his pocket. Desmond Polk. For Doss on the perimeter. Doss drives, lays it up and down. It's 11 again as Grayson Murphy brings it up. Murphy catches inside under the basket. This is Jackie Bisick. Now Wood again. Murphy in front of the Belmont bench. Through the lane, out for Wood. Three on the way is good. The ninth three-point basket of the night for Belmont. Right at their season average. Six minutes to play. Cam Williams. Doss on the left side. Cam Williams for three, trying to answer. No, Pruitt rebounds, comes down with it, and he's and it's knocked away. Richard the other way. Richard lays it up and down. 15 for the freshman, Will Richard. Carter dribbles into traffic and another takeaway. Smith ahead, Richard again. Back-to-back -back buckets for Richard, who's got 17 points now. And nothing run to push its lead out to 18, which is the largest of the night. Taylor between the circles. Around to his right, 
for Pruitt. Got it back. Shamar. Room for a three. Missed it. Doss with a rebound. Cutting underneath the basket. Here's right. Straight down the lane. Left hand finish for Shamar. 13 for Shamar Wright. Jacoby Wood into the front court for Belmont. Lost it and a jump. And possession arrow favors SIUE. Four and a half minutes left. Courtney Carter calling out of play with the left hand. Now switching hands on the dribble. Just six to shoot. Taylor with a long three on the way. No good. Rebound out front by Richard. Smith for, Brett, for bronze. Smith down the lane, scoops it high off the glass. 23 for Luke Smith. He's one off his career high. With just inside of four minutes to play in this one. Pruitt hands back to Carter for Shamar. He'll skip it left for Taylor inside Pruitt. Pruitt skips it back out. Here's Doss from the baseline. Missed it, rebound loose, and it's grabbed by Richard. Running out is Smith. He'll dump it off and Richard finishes. 19 for Will Richard. 20 point lead for Belmont, a foul called against Jacoby Wood. Will Richard closing in on his career high as well. Final 315 coming up from First Community Arena. Belmont up 20 on SIUE. 315 to play here at First Community Arena. Belmont has opened up a 20 point advantage on the SIUE Cougars. It's 80 to 60. They've got four in double figures, including Grayson Murphy, who's now got a triple double. He's got 11 points, 11 rebounds, and 10 assists tonight for the Bruins. They've collected 21 assists on 30 made baskets. They're shooting 56%. SIUE is shooting 46%. And the Bruins out rebounding SIUE 27-24. There's Grayson Murphy. He recorded the first triple-double in Belmont's Division I history. And now he's got another one tonight. Courtney Carter going to the free throw line for SIUE. Four points tonight. He's not been to the free throw line where he is a 57% shooter, and he missed it. So Belmont will take it back with the big lead and three minutes to play. Here in this one. Murphy hands away to Wood. Wood gives it off for Shepard. Shepard circles. Tried to hand it off and did. It was knocked away briefly. Shepard gets it back, misses the three. It rolled over the top of the backboard, and Doss comes away with it. Pruitt, short corner. Carter swings it right. Doss for three. Missed everything. Wood chases it down, but lost it out of bounds. He grabbed the rebound, but he couldn't hang on to the rebound. So SIUE will have it under the basket. Shot clock to 20, not a full exchange of possession there, or change of possession. Doss for three from the left side, missed. Pruitt got his hand on the rebound, but that's it. He knocked it out of play. So Doss will check out. Carter will come back in. And a 
blocking foul called against Carter, who thought he had drawn a charge. Two twenty-eight to play. Ben Shepard to the foul line. No, check it. It's Grayson Murphy at the foul line. He's not been to the free throw line so far tonight. He's only a 54% shooter at the foul line this year. And he misses. Taylor rebounds and brings it the other way. And Taylor's going to draw a foul from Murphy. Just as he started to get past him, Murphy reached out and grabbed him, or grabbed for him anyway. So Rayshon Taylor to the free throw line where he's scored four of his seven points tonight. 24, 2.24 to play. Taylor's missed two at the line tonight. No, he's only missed one. Take that back. He's four out of five tonight at the free throw line. Well, now he's missed two. Belmont takes it back with 2.20 to play. A little full court pressure from Cam Williams. Balls ahead for at Moorhead State on Thursday. That's the national game. It'll be on ESPN News. Two minutes and change to play in this one. That's going to be another big game, that matchup against Moorhead State. It'll be a rematch of the OVC Championship last year. And the fadeaway three, not there. The putback also not there. The ball's out of bounds, and it'll belong to SIUE. They'll play at Eastern Illinois and at Austin P as well. They don't play another home game till the 29th against UT Martin. SIUE also will make a run of road games coming up here after tonight's game. Carter out for Williams. Williams drives, dumps it off. Lamar finishes. Lamar, right. 93 seconds to play here in regulation time tonight. Smith across the timeline, working against fellow number three, Rayshon Taylor. Now it's Wood. Murphy. In the corner for Shepard. Shot clock to 10. Straight away for Murphy. Shot clock to three. Smith on the left side. Saw that he was running out of time, threw up a prayer, missed the shot, and the rebound is out for Shepard. And the ball comes, it's, comes all the way out for Grayson Murphy. Belmont made the most of that one with an offensive rebound. They've out-rebounded SIUE tonight. Shepard's going to try another three again as the shot clock was winding down. Cam Williams rebounds this time for SIUE. 33 seconds to play. Taylor's going to drive, dump it off for Lamar. Lamar finishes, and he draws the foul. Lamar, right. Taylor will pick up his fifth assist of the game, sixth assist of the game, make it. Good look for Rayshon Taylor, who again has had a tough night offensively, but he's Led the way for SIUE with six assists. And he'll sit as Lamar Wright goes to the foul line. Shot not there. Rebound for Murphy with 25 seconds left. The shot clock is off. Belmont's going to win this one to improve to 4-1 and one in OVC play. SIUE will drop to two and three, or I should say they'll drop to one and two in OVC play. Three road games to come for the SIUE Cougars. Four road